YouTube, what's going on? My name is Equagan. Today's video, we're going to go over Operation Seraph Shields. I'll do my best to try to break down what you're looking for, where you're going, and also I'll do my best to try to add on a few extra things, like the Resonance Amp, for example, has been re-enabled. Some of these cubes you're going to have to get in here. For example, I have Orbital Engineer Shaft Platform. Snow has the same, but I think Beta has a completely different one. So when we go through this, I'll try to show that off as well. And at the end, there is an extra chest that you can normally shoot for, but I already shot for it. But I'll still show that location. How do you start this mission? You have to get to step 23, okay? So week two ends at step 19. You start up, you come to the helm, you speak to uh, Mr. Bray Robot, and that's when it tells you to go do a heist battleground. You open up the chest. Once you open up the chest and you come back, it's going to send you to this little table here. And once you get to this little table, it's going to give you the quest for this pulse rifle called Revision Zero. Once you complete the mission, you're going to get this pulse rifle as well. Now, in terms of weapons and loadouts, you can use whatever you like. There are some arc shields in here. Um, there will be some Briggs. There's like one voice shield, the Servitor. Is it needed? Not really, because I'm match, you know, match, match game is not on. But if you ever done the Deepstone Crypt raid, then you kind of understand the jobs as you're going through this. There's going to be scanner, there's going to be operator, and there's going to be suppressor. All right, when you first start out, it's going to give you scanner. Usually with scanner, if you see something that's golden, that means you can interact with it. Also, if you're a Titan and you're going through this, you can easily run like a barricade shield. And if you feel like the thing is, you know, looking at you, right, you can put this up and boom, it goes out of your way. All right, so that may be a thing that you want to do. Maybe put on shoulder charge. Ooh, I'm going to die here possibly. Oh no, baby. Nope, didn't get me. As you can see, both of those got canceled, so now I can move. Yeah, you're gonna basically go through the, the entrance area. And this is it. You're gonna be dropping in. Watch out for lasers and things like that. There's gonna be lasers. You wanna jump over them. You wanna go under. Now there's two different paths, do not go forward. You come in, you're gonna be going to your left. You're gonna crouch, go under, jump over. Jump over. This area is a launch center, it says nerf. All right, so when you get in, you're gonna see basically the pod, same as the from Crypt. There's going to be a splicer. All right, you kill this guy. Once you kill him, you're gonna have stuff highlighted that you can interact with. And as you can see, here, we have this thing here. I hit the hack. There's going to be the pods that come down that uh, allows us to go up. All right, there's nothing else here. So, hack one there, hack two here. Hack three is gonna be right here. Once all three are hacked, you're gonna hear the thing go up and bad boys are coming down. All right, we're going up into the sky. Now we're on the second floor. Now usually when you when you get into certain rooms, you're gonna see Mr. Shower Bath thing here, right? You're gonna drop your scanner in, and that allows you to open up this door here. Now we, we're gonna come into another room, we're gonna have another scanner, all right? Pick this thing up. I can see, well, we have to go ahead and do the thing. the hell beta 
All right. So with scanner, I know that there's nothing in this room, right? But I see this yellow thing right here. So I have to hack it. Once I hack this, I'm gonna have a, the next thing that I need to hack. And you can see here, the next thing that you need to hack is inside. That means that we're gonna be going through this little spot right here. Normally you have to shoot it through, but I believe Beta already shot it for me. And now we're gonna enter that next room. Let me, let me, let me, let me in. And hacking. So if you end up uh, picking up the pulse rifle, it allows you to shoot uh, these like orange things. It allows you to shoot these things down. So we're gonna wait for beta to come in, but I think th these are individual base. You shot yours, right, Snurf? Yeah, I did, yeah. Okay. So right there, when I shot that, it gave me seraph uh, seraphic umbral energy as well. All right. There it goes. You can also sword in here if you have to. But I am going to shoulder charge. I go back. Out. Nope. Ooh. Oh my lord. Mm. Ah. All right. Now we're going back out. All right. Once we're out here, we can. This guy respawns all the damn time. I don't think we need him anymore, do we? No. All right. Last but not least is going to be this pad here. It seems like you have to hit three pads every time you're going into a location. The first encounter was three, and there's going to be three here as well. All right. So, me and Snurve have the resonance amp for... Orbital Engineer Shaft Platform. This is where it's located. If you end up getting this too, this is spot right here. A red board I Kellos. Thank you, game. All right. So, Resonance Amp is, is back up as well. And now I'm going to combine it again to see what I have. Now it says Orbital Engineer Servers Columns. I got, the, I got that as well. But I'm going to dump this into the shower. Here we are. Augmentation has been dumped. Now we're going to kill Az. And this fella dropped the scanner. The first one is going to be here. Boom. That is one. So, up here. You're going to shoot this thing down. And come inside. All right, that's number two there. Okay, so number two has been hacked. And number three is gonna be inside here. And as you can see, right, there's four different stations, okay? It's going to be this station here. That's going to be the second one to the to the left side of the wall. So when I go in this room, my augment gets deactivated. And you can see that there's four stations. The one that I need to hit is going to be the one that corresponds to the one down there. All right? So once you do that, and that was the third one, it's going to bring us to the next room. So you can kind of see this is always going to be in group of three. The next room is going to be a little bit trickier, and uh, after we kill up all these eyes, I'll kind of explain as well. Just 
generally as a scanner you need to hit three things in order to get to the next area so now after we kill these ads you're gonna this is gonna be the bottom right the bottom is flat you don't see what exactly what's going on here the only way that you can see what is happening here is if you have the scanner now when i pick up the scanner up top i'm gonna see which which uh which server like i guess which stations you can see which station that you can interact with so for me this is going to be two one three all right i go by whatever's closest to my left so that would be one this would be two that would be three that would be one that would be two that would be three that would be one that would be two and that would be three all right so this is going to be two one three all right once you remember that you're going to come down here and there's going to be a path this path is actually always going to be the same path. So if you need to memorize this for your solo, you can. But if you go in there, you step on the wrong path, you are going to die. Oh no. Guardian down. All right, crouch and then go to your left, Snurf. Yep. Yep, going up one more time. And move two, up. Two, one, three. Yeah, so it's, it's gonna, yeah, two, one, three. So you get that one. And then you're gonna be moving to your right twice. And then up to there's gonna be one, so that uh, the one that you walk up to right there, and then you're gonna be going to your. Think about where the stations are. Those are always safe spots, if that makes any sense. All right, you get. Yep, they're gonna move up to. They go that way, and then three. There you go. So once this is done, the door open up and this is safe. Another reason, uh, like what I just told Snurve as well, think about where the uh, the stations are. Those are always going to be safe spots for you. That means that the game is always gonna connect one thing to them usually. That is that room there. All right, Captain. All right, so now we're gonna start up with the operator. Okay, with operator, same thing as Deepstone Crypt. You see anything that's highlighted in the red, you should be able to shoot it. So I see this door, I shoot it. It opens up. You're gonna notice that this door tells me that I need security clearance upgrade to get through it. So, can't do anything there with it. Nerve, I hear music. If you come to me, this is going to be the node that we need. So, if you're watching this video right now, this node is going to be Orbital Engineer Server Column. All right? Picking that up. Another red border. That was actually two red borders back to back. These might be guaranteed. Now, I don't have... Oh, I, actually, I can combine one more. I can as well. Orbital Logistic Foil Hall. That's going to be the next one for me. All right, so the next thing to shoot is going to be in this room here. I'm shooting it. Sorry, beta. There he goes. After you clear up ads, you can shoot that thing down. The door is going to open up. Ooh, that guy just gave you a hug. All right. Now it seems like we're going to have to go under. When you get here, you should be able to see the next thing that you need to shoot to your right. <laughs> All right. Is there anything back here? Nothing. Just at that end. All right. So from from this room. You're going to shoot left button. After you shoot left button, you're going to go under. Once you go under, you go shoot in that next area. Oh, my Lord. Deaths are happening here. <laughs> Why you got to kill the man like that? Anyways, you shoot the thing on the left side. <laughs> All right. You shoot the thing on the left side there. You go under here in the next room. You go shoot the, the little thing to your right. Then after, there's going to be a little cubicle. A 
little spot here to the right that you're gonna go under. You're gonna see enemies, which means that you're going the right way. This knight is hiding behind cover. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And once you get in here, you can crouch and you can see the next thing that's across and you shoot that one. Once that's done, you can see that that door just opened up. You see it? Like as soon as I shot this, you're able to see where you're going next. Guardian down. For some reason for this one, Bungie likes you to do things in threes. This room is just annoying. Why is there so many little mines in this mode? I'm gonna put, put in my uh, my operator, and we end up in the first boss kind of room. I don't know if I want to call this guy a boss, but yeah, he's he's the first he's the first guy you gotta fight. Put down a flag. There's going to be Briggs in this room. They're really annoying, but it's whatever. The way to start is just by shooting all that stuff. Or or doing the beta and just going to dine on your own. Gotta wait for the boss and shield to come down. There it is. All right, boss and shield is up. And now, just add clear. Why am I so charge? I am trying to... I'm over here trying to freaking uh, thunder clap people and my little titan arms are just swinging side to side. Breaks on this level are so much, uh, let's say, easier to deal with than on Legend. to the next area ah. now this part once you get here you're gonna see ads at the door it's gonna ask you to put away your weapons at this little area here so we're gonna surrender weapons once that is done your weapons get taken away from you and now the waiting game all right we got teleported now you don't have to kill all these ads. All you have to do is interact with the first thing on the left, which is uh, if you have done Beyond Light, there's going to be, or even if you've done the, the, the Scourge raid, there's these, oh, well, let me receive my weapon transmitter real quick. It's these little stations that you can work with. So if you click on game ship access, it's going to unlock these little break tech security frames. And you don't have to sit here and fight these ads. All you have to do is move up to the next thing and it should give you ship access, which will open this up. 
There you go. Now you can move on. You can stay there and then kill these things and help your homies out as well. But you can see they don't need it. They're they're pretty. They're pretty uh good. Next part is probably everyone's favorite, the jumping puzzle. All right. You know, who, who doesn't love jumping puzzles? Look at this. Look how crazy this looks, huh? Look at all this. It's beautiful. Yeah. When you first get it, like, oh, man, where do I need to go? You're going to be dropping down. down. If you see those red dots there, that kind of, like, tells you where you're going. There's no Mr. Beta as well. As you're going through this, see, watch out for the rotating turbine looking things. Because they will kill you. All right. That thing's going up. We can move. If you're a Titan, you can definitely Titan skate through this as well. I'm not doing that because, you know, people have to actually know the path. And this is the, the path to kind of do it. There's going to be enemies that show up as well while you're going through this path. It's going to be snipers. have an operator and with this guy here he's going to basically allow you to shoot the next things to go up on all right so you move up you pick this up and you're going to notice that as you get closer where is it right there the first one is going to be right under you let me pick up all right now you jump up here second one where is the second one no i can't shoot that one can i shoot that one? nope the second one is here my apologies the first one oh i'm going to die here the first one's there the second one is here and then the third one is there all right i didn't shoot the second one when we first did this so i didn't know that that was the second one but yeah first one's there Second one is here, and third one is right there. That is going to uh, open these steps up for you. Especially if you're like doing the solo flawless, it's probably nice to know these things, unless you're just gonna be, you know, skating through as a Titan. So you have a few more ads to take care of. Yep, you get up here, you have acid kill. And same thing again. You put in your augmentation and it's gonna open the door. Pick up this ammo because we are going to be fighting our buddy here. There he goes, he's back. Is that the node? This is the node that we need. This node is orbital logistic for your hall. And it seemed like all of these are guaranteed red borders. I like got engineer pillar, whatever that means. I have engineer orbital pillar. control nexus upload. Hmm. Okay. Then maybe we can show that. All right, in this room, you're actually going to be using operator and scanner. So this is going to be able to open up that door there. And generally you can open up both if you want to. And then once you open up both, now you don't have to worry about, uh, also when you open up both, just watch out for exploders. But when you open up both, now you can switch your job to scanner the whole time, right? So 
I'm gonna drop this in here. In order to switch, you have to drop that down and then you can pick up the other. It's just like Deep Stone. Now that I drop that in there, I can pick this up. I know that I open up both doors and now I can interact with what I need to. So, in this room here, there's one. Bam. In the next room, there's going to be two. Doors open. Now in the next section. I'm going to drop the scanner in because I don't need it right now. I'm going to pick up the operator. I'm going to be shooting this here. We're just going to open up this door. We're going to kill these eyes. You're going to see that there's there's a scanner in there. So I, what I can do is I can drop the operator back in and I can go and pick up the scanner. In this room here, this is going to be the third one. So if I hack this, we now have a new objective. As Lord Shanks are going to show up. Get rid of them. But as you can see, we, we did two in that room and one here. Once that is done, this portal opens up. We can go up. All right. I'm dropping this in once again to open up the next door. That's just how it goes. You drop it in to open up the next thing. Now we are going to be going into the suppressor realm. All right. This little buddy here is a suppressor. You pick this up, you go under, and you can shoot this guy, right? So that's one, go under, that's two, come right here, that's three, all, and you shoot this. Once you do all three, you come in, you're going to see this thing just like Deep Stone Crypt. You shoot it down, it's going to break his shield off, then it allows you to do damage. Same thing. You got to give up the augmentation. It's almost like you're giving up a key to open up a door. I don't think there's anything. So we need to open up this door. I don't think there's a, uh, a scannable thing here either. All right. I'm placing a rally banner. Basically doing the same thing in this encounter. This is Mr. Praxis. We killed him before. Yes have all right so once you send him a damage you're gonna have a suppressor that shows up you kill him and you're basically doing the same thing that you did in deep stone if you have done deep stone before with the buff you go under each thing and you shoot at him. So I did one and two. And now I'm going to the third. All right. If I didn't fall, but. Now at the third, shoot that off. And his shield should be coming off. Oh, am I going crazy? I got one mechanic come over here. Is there a mechanic you, after you have, you have to shoot oh, these bombs you have to on shoot the, the balls. Right. Yeah. Yep. And then there's one on the left side. I completely forgot about the damn uh, the bomb thing. It's almost like Deep Stone Crypt, but they added an extra layer. All right, should be damage time. Did I not blow that up? Oh my, going crazy. There's a middle one there as well. Oh, you forgot the middle suppressor. Yep, there it is. What do you mean? You told me it was left and right. If you're watching this oh, video, there's a middle bomb too. If you're watching this video, there's oh, a middle yeah, bomb. There there's a left and a right. Each are tied to the suppression uh, locations. Now, if I can get this thing to dismiss on my screen, it'll be awesome.
All right, I'm going after suppressor now. Looking this up. Shooting boss. Shooting boss. Oh my, this is like a whole field here. Shooting boss. Now these doors should be open. Left has been shot. Going to mid. Mid has been shot. And I am going right. Right has been shot. Boom, his shield should be coming off. Dead. All right, so now we're going to be going to the left. There was a thing in there to shoot. Didn't we already shoot it, though? Yeah, we're we going to show up. So if you have the pulse, you can go in here, and there should be a, a ball to shoot. But I believe we already shot it, so there's no oh, point. I think my thing is sinking. Guardian down. Oh, it's over here, Snurf. What was yeah, the name yeah, of yours? My, um, this one is Orbital Control Nexus Upload. Right here? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm about to open it. All right. All right. So now when you get here, we can upload virus. So that's what I'm doing. Virus has been uploaded. Emergency as it activated. And ladies and gentlemen, you are done. That is the Seraph Shield mission completed. It actually gave me enough resonance them. Let's see if it gives me this one. Yeah, it gave me this one. Oh, nice. That is it for this for this video. I do appreciate you guys checking out the content. Don't forget we have a merch star up. If you're trying to get like a trucker cap, a hoodie, a t-shirt, a mug, a berth, uh, a bathrobe. Not a berth robe, but a bathrobe. I don't know if there's a birth robe out there, but a bathrobe. Make sure you guys check out equagon.net. But I'll see you guys on the next one. Deuces.